Hi there, I'm Jim Coffey. I design and create automata. I'm in my studio in Escondido, California. It's the 1st of June, 2020. COVID-19 is in control of the world at the moment. You're looking at, generically, an automata that I call a product spinner. Specifically, this is two-tier number one. That's the name of this automata. And it's not for sale. It's designed to be rented. Uh, it's designed to operate in a retail environment, sitting on a countertop, or in a convention environment, sitting on a countertop, uh, for month after month after month. Shopkeeper comes in in the morning, turns it on. During the day, it sits there and rotates and displays things that the shopkeeper would want to have featured. Hopefully, the motion and just the fact that it's a little piece of art would attract attention, allow conversation, allow increased sales. That would be the goal of this. If somebody rents this, the, the objective would be to increase their sales. As I play my street organ in public, uh, people are fascinated with the monkey that sits on it. It's an animated monkey. And at times, I have been able to take big wheel lift number one with me and have it set up adjacent to my organ operating. So it's an automata that's got a big wheel on it that lifts marbles to the top and then they run down to the bottom and recycle through. It doesn't do anything except it just fascinates people. They, many of them just kind of get lost in it. People like automata. People like automata for ones that have little people in them. It causes you it causes there to be a link between you as a human and the automata that's got a little human in it. If this was just two rotating platforms, it would be very different. I'm going to turn this just slightly so you can... So this automata is about 20 inches high, about 13 inches in diameter, and it weighs about five pounds. It's manufactured, it's created uh, all by me. It's designed all by me and created by me, primarily using wood. There are a lot of ball bearings in here, stainless steel shafting, things of that nature. There's a six watt electric gear motor that powers it. So here we have it displaying marbles and chainsaw oil and it's flying a delightful little blue painter's tape pennant. The products on the turntable could be anything. They could be jewelry, works of art, watches, marijuana, pharmaceuticals, candy, a lot of things. And rather than painter's tape, that would be logo or something of that nature, a store name. If I had set out to design the motion of this biped if I had set out to actually design the way it now moves, I don't know that I could have done it. 
I don't know how I could have done it. I, if I'd wanted to, I would have done it. But, but just by the way it was assembled, by the way it's been created, it has these natural motions, these little body motions, little torso motions that I happen to like. If you're interested in renting this automata, if you have something in your mind that you'd like me to consider building for you that you could rent or buy, contact me, let me know. I love to do this kind of work. Stay healthy. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.